Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to learn how we can create a brand new repo using Azure DevOps. So with that said, let me go straight over to the Azure portal. And I'm going to enter my credentials. My passwords. I'm in all right so this is my landing page or my home page in Azure so here I'm gonna type Azure DevOps and here what I'm going to do is click on my Azure DevOps organization And what this would do is it will take me to a page where I can create uh, my organization, create sub projects inside of their organization and then, um, you know, create repos. So right now it is listing one organization. So right now there is one organization what, that I have and inside of this organization, I've got some projects. So let's say I want to create a brand new organization from scratch. So I'm going to say create new and I'm just going to say, okay, I can tick this one or leave it unticked. I'm just going to say continue. And here I'll have to specify the name of my organization. So I'm going to say uh, the IT videos. Let's call that the organization. Uh, I'm not sure if it's available or not. Let's find out. Looks like that is available. And it's going to take a moment and now the organization as you can see is created so on the left hand side it's listing two organizations so right now i've created i've just created the it the first one just now and inside of that i can create projects so i can choose to keep it private or or public so let's keep it private for now i'm just gonna say project one um or let's say test project one and let's say create project and once this project is created inside of this project i can create multiple repos so the way it works is so let's say we have um, one big organization right let's call this or organization right we've got one organization something we just created now right and inside of this organization we have got multiple projects and each of this project can have a repo right it can have its own repo so so let's call it you know repo one repo two so on and so forth so first thing we have is the top level is the organization right and then we have these projects so you may choose to have just one project the project uh it's nothing but a collection of all the all, all the repos that's where you have all your releases so on and so forth so if you look at if you look at this URL, for example, right? If you look at this URL from Microsoft, for example, you'll get a better understanding of how um, how they have structured. So, at the top level, we have the organization, and then we have the project, and then we have um, you know the repos inside of that. So that's how they have structured it. All right. So let's create our um, first repo so in my left hand side i can see all these links i can click on the repo and uh, click on the plus and say new repository and i can choose to have the repository type as git and just say my test app and i can say uh, 
I can initialize it by adding the readme file and if I'm creating a Visual Studio solution I can search for I can search for Visual Studio and click on the create button and then it's gonna go ahead and create that repo so as you can see this has this is the structure so we have the organization the project and inside of that we have all the repos as shown in this structure so this is a repo pretty much ready to go and we can add more stuff into this the, this is how we create a repo using azure devops thanks for watching and if this video has helped you in any way shape or form please let me know and thank you for watching